Hey my friend, I'm Enzo, the founder of Prism, and thanks for opening up this video. Today I'm going to give you a quick overview of the step-by-step -step process that we use to get record-breaking results for practices that work with us. In fact, Mataria Dental Group just broke the record for the most new patients they've ever had in a single month, so huge shout out to them, and I promise to give you something useful here if you lend me your attention for the next few minutes. This framework is exactly the one that we use to launch tech products at Apple when we used to work there, and even if you don't end up partnering with Prism, at least you'll have an idea of how the top companies in the world are getting these crazy results and why they're investing so heavily in the online components of their business. Uh, this process here has eight key steps and the steps immediately kick off after you submit your first payment. But really all of these steps and phases are wrapped around your unique story. So this is your story, you know, as a founder and the story of the people within your business, you know, the different other dentists that may work there, dental assistants, office managers, you know, every part of your business, you have a very unique story to it. Culture of your company, and like what patients really think about you. This is really like what a brand really is, you know, and what we're going to be really trying to develop. And the thesis that we have is that we actually partner with dentists and that already have a really beautiful business story, right? They already provide awesome, awesome services for their patients. Their patients already love them. And so we just want to work to help elevate their online presence of their business to that, you know, kind of in-person brand they have with that kind of close local community a lot of times um, and elevate that further to help get patients in through the door and, and get that word out there so new patients hear about how great you and your practice are. So that's a, the general kind of philosophy here. So you'll see kind of in the first, the starting up of this thing as you submit your payment, the first thing we work on is the strategy. And so you can see here, like the way that this this diagram is laid out is we have the key kind of step um, and then the key technology to get the best result possible for that phase. That's another one of the philosophies that we have at Prism is just that like we should always be delivering the best possible product like on the software side the best experience we possibly can and really spend a lot of time figuring out who's innovating and what kind of companies we can partner with to really give our dental practices the best possible online branding and online business that they can have on the strategy side of it this is where we really want to understand everything from your business so a lot of times you'll have an existing kind of website or like some kind of online presence maybe some social media or some articles written about you and so our team will leverage these tools i mean gpt open ai microsoft have been innovating super heavily in this space. So we like to partner with them to do an audit and really understand your unique brand, your business, your story. Um, we might ask you for some details about that. And once we have an idea of like what that story is and like what kind of your USPs are, your unique selling points of your practice, um, we're going to really, really like crank on those and make that build as much leverage behind those unique selling points of your business as possible and kind of massage that into your entire online presence and your brands, your website, social media, Google Maps, Apple Maps, those types of things. Anyways, I'm getting excited here. So once we have that kind of strategy thought out, we have, OK, like an idea of what we kind of want to build. Then we'll go into Reloom, which is another really innovative company based here in uh, Silicon Valley. And we're going to go into Reloom and from that strategy, build a site map. OK, so you can see here that I'm in Chrome now. And that's what I'm going to kind of do is show you, give you a little bit of insight into some of these tools. Um, I don't want to make the video too long. I could talk about this for a really long time. So I'm just going to try to skim over it and reach out to us if you have any specific questions. Um, so this is, we use Reloom to build out a site map. And so this is kind of an outline, a visual outline and like a skeleton of what your website would look like. So this is one of our clients, um, Town Center Dental here. Please don't share any of this information outside. This is just meant for you to see. Um, but you can see here that we start to build out a skeleton of the About Us page, services, contact, patient forms, right? These different pages. Um, and these are all built on that strategy and that story that we had built in the second phase or the in an earlier phase, right? And then we go into this helps us to build out a wireframe um, from here. Like again, this is like a skeleton of you can see these these this content isn't necessarily filled out yet, but we kind of have some idea of like if they want to get in contact us. There's a maps here we can integrate with Google Maps, add FAQs, you know. So we start to build out a framework for what each of these pages would kind of start to look like. But again, it's pretty bare bones. It's pretty bare bones. So that was this the step. Now we have a built out site map uh, from Reloom, and the next step is going to be going into Figma to do the UI design. So this is where we're going to really customize and tweak the visual assets. Sometimes this involves video too. Um, we'll, we'll bring in some other really powerful video editing tools and processing tools into the stack too, along with Figma. Figma is really for the UI, the user interface design. So like the buttons, like where everything is going to be um, layout wise on your page and then how it's all going to look like what's, what's your unique brand logo, your color scheme, and what, what's this, 
you know, each, what's the ideal place for each of these different components? Figma is this one here. Um, and so you can see like that this is really the most powerful way to build software products in the world right now. Like whether you're doing web apps like this or like mobile apps, a lot of your favorite apps you'll see here are built using this technology. So again, this is like GitHub, Coinbase, Airbnb, Asana, you're probably familiar with these. This is the best tool possible. We use the best tools possible for our clients. And so you can see here that this lets us really get down to the development level and the design level to customize all the color to make it perfect for you uh, and your story and your brand. After we get all that built out and it looks really beautiful, we have an idea of like what we want it to do. Then we go in and actually put it into the working website, right? That people can actually interact with and um, touch and we can play with. We'll send over links to you. This is called the staging environment. It's kind of like a test, like a sandbox environment for us. So no actual public people will be able to see it. We'll just, you and your team and us will be able to collaborate and figure out, um, you know, pretty much see the working product uh, and make little tiny tweaks to make sure that it's absolutely perfect before we go ahead and push it all public. Uh, and so this is where, you know, we've taken, we've used this tech stack of Reloom Figma. So we have like some, a visual design that's like static, but you can't really actually click with the buttons and navigate around different pages, right? So this is where we bring it into the next platform up, the next stage. Uh, and that's where we use Webflow. So Webflow is the most powerful way to build web apps and web and websites now. Um, it's very, very technical. So like, it's kind of hard to, if you don't know how to use it, it's hard to build uh, build with. But if you know how to use it and you can, you can really take advantage of all its capabilities, you can get really, really good results for your business. So, you know, obviously this is, it's huge companies use this. And I'm, I'm sure you guys are familiar with some of these like Grubhub. Um, and it's designed for growth, you know, like it has, it plugs into all of these different platforms. Um, again, like layers underneath that are going to allow us to give you a really, really good product, give you a really good website that really allows you to connect with lots of people. And when those people actually come, whether they're new patients or existing patients, they'll have a phenomenal, like delightful experience on your website. They'll just love it. It'll feel like their favorite app. It'll feel like Instagram or something like that, right? Like they just, they love engaging with it. That's the feeling that we want to, that we deliver. Now we have a staging environment built out. Um, and once everything is really getting close to getting ready to go public, then we'll start to add in some content. So a lot of times too, um, this is a, str a strategy decision that we'll make. Sometimes we've actually pushed the website public here and then we want to sprinkle in and start to add really good engaging content again. So that when people land there, they, they have really good stuff to engage with. Like they really feel like they're connected to you and your business. Like, oh yeah, I could really see myself going to this dentist or, um, and they really are able to get the information that they need, whether that's about certain services or getting to know certain people at your office, getting to know you and your story. So we do video interviews with yourself and with the other people on your team and then build those and warp them into written articles as well and like full on web pages that live out around your website. So you could see that there'd be a web page where someone could watch and learn more about your story as the doctor. And like we have a video interview about like your career journey, how you got started and what you're working on and focus on right now. And then all of that written out as well and that'll be its own page. And you'll have, imagine another video and page for the office manager or for like the secondary dentist or, you know, these different people at the office. And so people can really go to your website and just feel like they already know you when they walk in through the door. That's like the main feeling that we're trying to deliver here. And that's the interviews phase. We're getting pretty close to the end here, but on the interviews phase. So again, we have these three great, super powerful tools. Fourth super powerful tool is called Riverside. And this is one that's used by top companies. Again, Microsoft, Verizon, Netflix, Marvel, Ted, New York Times, you know, you're probably familiar with some of these people using these tools. Um, and so we use these top of the line tools to create really good content with you and your team and then wrap that in these beautiful designs, these beautiful, powerful web pages that just live on your website with, again, these steps we'd used previously. So it's all very interconnected. It's an interconnected stack and system that we've been working really hard on developing. And that's why it gets such good, good results. And it's really hard to replicate. It just takes a lot of work to do this. That's the reason why we've had so much success here. Here. You just think about like, you know, other competing dentists that just, they aren't going to this level above and beyond on the software side and the online components of their business. That's why this works. Patients can really feel that, like how much better, you know, how much time and, and effort and attention to detail is put into these, the, every place of your business. Um, so those are the people that we want to work with, people that really care about that. 
Uh, the next thing that we'll do is make sure that you're in really good standing and have a really strong partnership. Your dental practice has a really strong partnership with Google and with Apple. And so the way that we do that, we get we wire up the your Google and Apple business profiles. And so that'll help you people find you easier. It'll help you with um, you being found in different search engines. Like when somebody Google searches you, they'll find you. But then also making sure that you're your profile, like your map is set up. Like, so when somebody searches for you on Apple Maps or Google Maps, you'll show up high to the top and people will see like photos of you and your team and be like, oh, so that when they see a list and they search for a dentist nearby, they'll, they'll tap on yours and go through that route of hopefully view the website, learn more about you. Oh yeah, that, yeah, these guys seem awesome. I'm gonna go to them, right? That's like the ideal kind of uh, customer journey, patient journey that we wanna give somebody. So we get those super, super optimized so that you're always in really good standing. Um, with these big tech companies and to make sure that you're ranking high, you know, on maps and on search. And that's the next part, right? Right? Like SEO, search engine optimization. So there are multiple search engines that we look at now. Um, and that's why this one is so great here. This is SEMrush or SEMflow, excuse me. SEMrush is another tool that we use. Um, you can see here that it's actual, you know, it's designed for dental. Like you can see here, this is like a teeth whitening page. And so um, this literally gets, it's like a technical tool that really gets us, lets us get into the back end and dig out and make sure that everything is really optimized again so that you're ranking higher. You're able to outrank those other dentists in your local area. You know, so when somebody searches dentist San Francisco, you're at the top, you know, not, not the, the practice down the street or whatever, right? There's a lot of things that we do um, to make, and we're constantly battling these other businesses on the software side. And so that's why we use these really powerful tools to beat to beat them out and to rank higher. And the last thing is just the content engine. So the content, the, the major thing about this and the reason why um, we get such good results, but it, it also, you know, it takes a lot of work is because it's ongoing. And so what we're gonna do now is that once all this, now we have, once we've gotten past, you know, really this phase, all of these, the platform is really set up for us. And so now we just wanna make it, start growing things on it, make it as good as possible, make it really, really, really good and start planting all these little seeds. Your content, like the every post on Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, TikTok, or every post, um, blog post, article written about you online or attached to your website, YouTube video that points back to your website, all these little things, like you have a footprint online, right? And we're gonna try to, make that as powerful as possible. So you can kind of think of it like we have this platform now and every piece of little content is like a seed. We're, we're putting these, we're planting these seeds all over the internet and so that people can, they'll start to grow. And as people engage with them, they'll start to grow, they'll start to grow. And then when you have, eventually you have these trees all over the internet, right? And people can really easily find you. Oh, that's your tree. So I hope that that analogy um, didn't fall through, but that's basically what we're trying to do here. So all this to say is that when, we're really thoughtful when we set up this whole thing so that it's very efficient to maintain a content engine and to distribute content across, um, you know, we can kind of shoot something once. Maybe we shoot a video, write a piece of content with you and your team once, but then we'll distribute that. We, we build a, you know, an infrastructure so that it can be efficiently distributed across your entire online business. So again, like website, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, right? LinkedIn, like all the different places. And so that it's optimized for each of those different platforms. Um, and so that's, that's the last thing. And we work really closely with our partners to make sure that that's always super tuned. And then everything else along this, you know, kind of path will continue to use these things. So like when we make a, updates to the website, if you want to add a new page or we think there's a new page that should be added, or we're working on a campaign maybe for a referrals for, you know, one patient rec recommends another patient, then we'll use a staging environment and send that back to you and your team to make sure that we're all really signed off on it before it goes live. So um, yeah, there's just like, uh, you know, it's a really beautiful process. It does take a lot of work. And, but like I said, this is exactly how we launch products and ship products and features and software, hardware products, like in the technology industry, these are the exact tools that we use. Um, and we live in a global marketplace place now, right? You can reach the world if you use the online tools that are at your disposal. So I hope this helped. I, like it, I hope it piques some interest, like maybe explore some of these tools and do some research into them and how you could you know, work them into your business. Um, and if you really want to just launch this thing off to the next level, again, we would love to partner with you. Uh, and because this is what we love to do. This is what we've been doing our whole lives. Uh, and it's just getting better, right? Everything is constantly, people, these companies are constantly innovating, changing. The best practices are constantly, you know, moving. And so that's our job is to figure out how do we put you in the perfect place amongst this entire landscape so that you're, 
business is able to thrive and grow and you're able to connect with awesome patients. Thank you so much for taking this valuable time out of your day to explore these, this framework with me. And I'm really excited to hear your thoughts.